we're back in Minneapolis, getting used to our life again, and uh, we've been really busy. Sorry for the the hiatus. I can't believe that a week without videos feels like a hiatus. I know. <laughs> well, we were driving home. That's the main problem. And when we're driving nine hours a day, we can't. Yeah. Edit or film. Yeah. I asked Hannah to stay out of the frame because I want to do a grand reveal. Um, she got these glasses that are blue light and uh, they make her eyes not melt yeah. when she looks at the computer and she looks so sexy. It's just because you like glasses. You think I look like Alex Voss. I do think you look like Alex Voss, but I think you look like Hannah with your beauty uh, multiplied by about 10 million. Wow. So let's do the grand reveal. Everyone, get ready. <laughs> this is gonna be a letdown. Dun, 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 dun. And she got her hair done. I did. Hey! Where's my glasses? Your you're too zoomed. There you go. Well, the lights uh -huh. There's my glasses. Now you can see the reflection. <laughs> I like them. I can I've always it. wanted glasses because I've never had them, so that's why. You know, like my vision's too good. I've my vision's been... perfect, but I, I wanted to be able to wear glasses, so. What a door. <laughs> Horrible, terrible Spinraza update. Uh, I'm not going to be able to have my injections done at the hospital where I've been. Still don't know what other hospitals might accept my insurance. When were you supposed to get it? Like soon, like in two weeks. Yeah. There's no way that's going to happen. If I am late to an injection because of insurance and hospital crap, and I lose more muscle, I'm going to freak out. <laughs> okay, I can't take myself seriously in these glasses. Um, oh, you don't play better with I'll them. Right? <laughs> I'll just keep that part of my head out. Uh, we posted about this issue on Instagram like a month ago, I guess, right? Because we were yeah. in Florida at the yeah. beginning. Yeah, it was like a month ago. Shane, have you not been putting enough positivity out into I've the universe? I've been sending all the positive vibes that I have. Huh. At the hospital, and they don't seem to be changing their mind because of that. I mean, you've spent like an entire work week, like 40 hours on the phone, most likely. Trying to resolve this. Since yeah. then, yeah. And nothing has come of it. So, no progress yet. On our last day in Florida, we went to an outdoor food truck festival thing, but they have it like year round. So, not a festival. It's at called all. Celebration Park in Celebration Naples. Celebration Park in Naples. <laughs> uh, my new favorite place on earth. Cause it's an outdoor bar on the water with like 10 food trucks, all different kinds of food. We didn't film a lot of audio while we were there because it was loud. So this is the intro to the clips that you're about to see. What is that? You need to say what that oh, is. I have no idea. All right, Shane and I have been going through cards that we got while we were gone. We just wanted to say that we've loved reading all of these. It was so thoughtful of everyone. Everyone was so kind. Show the one with the reindeer. I the love reindeer. that one. Check out this card. So cool. Aww. Hmm, which one's Some my really favorite? really beautiful ones. I really like this one. That is you in that heart right there. I know, there. I love that. Little animals and flowers. Mm -hmm, that reminds me of like Easter, you know, like springtime. I just love that. So anyway, I mean, thank we could you, go everyone. through every single one and talk about them, but thank you. I would like it to be known that I am wearing an adult-sized shirt. Adult small. Adult, like, super, super small. <laughs> People are asking, am I getting bigger? No one has asked you that. It's a possibility. No, it's not. <laughs> Just an extra small shirt. Yeah, this is from a brewery. Brewery. Shane was so excited to finally wear a shirt that was like adult, you know? <laughs> I wear a kid's medium. Yeah. That's what size shirt I wear. So and it's so, usually like kid themed clothing. This is an adult <laughs> This is an adult small that happens to be also the same size as a as a kid medium. Chloe. This is an adult small that happens to be Kid medium size. So you're officially not getting bigger. We can roll that out. I feel like I'm expanding. Am I? 
Is my head closer to the top of the frame than it was when we began? Oh, okay, sure. Nope. Help. Just so everyone knows, uh, I am going to be actively petting Chloe during this video. Hannah's fondling the dog. She recently saw a squirrel out our window, and we are working on remaining calm when you see a squirrel, not throwing yourself against the window, uh, not screeching, and so it helps her to Have be rub. petted. <laughs> yeah, she's coming over for pets to, you know, regulate her motions. So that's what I'm doing. I'm not. Yeah, I don't know if you see me moving. It's very similar to what Hannah does to regulate her emotions. Like, she'll be getting dead and grumpy, and like, in that kind of like, rah, rah, like, every little thing is bothering her, and rather than like, you know, processing it like an adult that wears adult size clothing, uh, she'll come up to me and just kind of rub her this face spot. into Ooh. my... She's like, rah, rah, rah. That's my go-to spot when I'm upset. I go so right here, now. I'll pet you. Yeah. You can just I'm it. fine right now. I don't need that. Yeah. Thanks. So, as you all know, we are back in Minneapolis. I think for the past week, we've been sad about coming home, obviously. It's freezing cold and whatever. What are you doing? So you push my hair a little, little bit in the front. Are you kidding? No, I just realized my hair is horrible. I mean, we just got up like 10 Yeah, it's ago. morning time. I woke up like this. I feel like other people that make YouTube videos like prepare. Like, I had a time. look nice. Mm -hmm. We don't. Very often I'm like, oh, I'm looking at my hair halfway through the video. We're normally straight out of bed. <laughs> um, anyway, sorry. Oh, anyway, for the past week we've been sad about coming home, but I think one thing has kept us going alive. Alive. And that has been the prospect of going to Trader Joe's. And filling our freezer. We have no food here because we were gone for so long. There were no, well, there was a Trader Joe's kind yeah. of near our we didn't go. area in Florida, but we, it was kind of It was far. too far, yeah. But we love ourselves some Trader Joe's. Yeah. If you're not familiar with Trader Joe's, how would you describe it? A small chain Heaven? of grocery stores. Yes. Well, they're not that small. They're pretty big. Yeah. The stores themselves are physically small. That's what I thought you meant. Right, right, they're not, yeah. they're not like huge grocery stores. They're, they're small stores. And they stock their own food. And so it's all like Trader Joe's food. And they their food is of, amazing. It's like specialty items. Like they have the regular grocery stores like milk and like yeah. vegetables. But they have a lot of like prepared yes. meals and dips. With uh, healthy ingredients, like you can read the ingredient list and it's all stuff that we could have made. Yeah, this sounds like your Trader Joe's ad. It's, it's not an ad. It's not. However, Trader Joe's, if you'd like to get in touch. Oh <laughs> but I recently found an Instagram account that's like Trader Joe's food reviews and I told yeah. Shane about it and now every day we're going through there and this woman reviews the food and so I found a bunch of stuff that I want to try and we're really excited to go. So today is our big Trader Joe's haul, but last night, Chloe, but last night uh, we popped over just for a few essential items yeah, like, like milk. coffee, yeah, stuff like that. And Shane got himself, want to talk about it? I got this life changing spaghetti squash casserole, which was a frozen meal that was Diced up spaghetti squash, um, like cheese, cream, breadcrumbs. It was like a sludge. It was amazing. I didn't even try it. Some some of the foods. I have leftovers. Uh huh. Breakfast. Oh, Breakfast. I just got so happy. All this Trader Joe's talk yes. reminded me just now. Do you remember the worst one of the worst dates we ever had when we went in Bethlehem? Pennsylvania to try to find that Trader Joe's. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that. Okay, you want to hear about a horrible, horrible day oh that we god. had? There are no Trader Joe's remotely near Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. And I kept telling Shane about them, you know, because they're here and I love them. This is like three years ago. I'd yeah. never been to a Trader Joe's before. Hannah told me like how amazing they were. Yeah. And I was like, they sound... She was like, they have an aisle of only dip. <laughs> and I was like, why don't I live there? Um, so one day, Hannah was visiting in Pennsylvania, and I <laughs> kind of like to surprise her, but also because I thought it would be a cute, fun thing, found a Trader Joe's that was like 30 minutes away, and I was like, Hannah, I found one. <laughs> Where's Hannah go? I feel 
feel like I should have known that something was awry because, like, we knew there weren't any Trader Joe's. <laughs> I know, we talked about it. I, like, I checked the Trader Joe's website. It was, like, store locator. And the closest one was, like, three hours away. Or probably in Philly. I'm sure there's one in Philly. So it's probably, like, an hour and a half away, and we weren't willing to go to Philly. But I remember having heard whisperings. <laughs> you looked on Google Maps. You typed in Trader Joe's. Yeah, and, I, and Trader Joe's came up 30 minutes away, <laughs> and I remembered that people had been talking about how the Lehigh Valley, the area I was from, was going to get a Trader Joe's. Oh. So I was like, oh, it must have happened. Uh-huh. You know? So we drove. We get in the car. Yeah, it was it was pretty far. We're driving, we're driving. We get to the general area. We're really out in the middle of nowhere. We're in a strange place. It's a, it's like an industrial park. It like feels and an industrial Yeah. Like, like really dessert. <laughs> and I was like, it would be odd for Trader Joe's to suddenly... Pop up here of all places. But there were no other stores. No. It was all warehouses. Yeah. So we're driving along. I'm on my map. And Hannah's like, on the left. Hannah's like, Shane, are you sure we're going the right <laughs> way? And I was like, uh-huh, uh-huh. And we were so sure we were going to come across the Trader Joe's. <laughs> like, looking back, we just, I, like, I can't believe how sure we were. And I'm following the map. They're like, right here, turn right, turn right. We turn into a parking lot. <laughs> it's a warehouse for Trader Joe's. <laughs> it's a little, it's, yeah, it's like their factory we arrived. And there were like people going to work with like lunch boxes. They yeah. were heading into the factory. Yeah. And we were like, we pulled in. <laughs> and Shane was still like, do you think they sell? <laughs> do you think they sell their stuff here? And I was like, oh no, I don't, like there was no business. There was no entrance. way. No, no, it, it wasn't. wasn't. Yeah. So then. As our, I mean, it was hilarious, but yeah. we had to, like, redeem this, like, date day somehow. Yes. So, I was like, well, Wegmans is another grocery store that's, like, different, but they have, like, hot food that you can eat there. Yeah. So, I was like, why don't we go to Wegmans yeah. and have a nice, like, lunch later? Yeah. So, we're driving to Wegmans. I remember that you were sick. I was. Like, I remember you coughing, and I, I remember being like, we don't have to go. Like, yeah. we must go home. You know, but we wanted to, to actually do something. And this was still back in those days when I was, like, really hurting. Yeah. And I was like, no, no, I'm fine. <laughs> I, let's have fun. <laughs> Sorry about the Trader Joe's. Come here. So we walk into Wegmans. Well, we drive 30 minutes. Well, we drive 30, yeah, probably like 45 minutes. I think we're, I think we're under-exaggerating how far this warehouse district was. But we drive to Whiteman's, and we go inside, and I don't know what made us think of this. Like, I don't know why. We were walking in, and I was just like, do we have our wallets? I think maybe we had taken it out to, like, buy something online. Like, yeah. there was some reason that we checked, and we did not have either of our wallets. Uh, so now... The idea number two is ruined. Yeah, I think you're like close to tears at this point. I'm, I'm, I'm like real sad. You're like getting annoyed. You were no, I wasn't getting annoyed. I remember you were grumpy. Oh, I like was. You pissed. got into the car and you were like yeah. really upset. And I, Shane rarely gets upset. I was worried that you were getting annoyed. Yeah, but you were like Shane, like, like oh this is God. funny. Yeah, that so was they, still back when I was like on my best behavior. So something like that now, I would be like, oh my God, like uh, where's my wallet? But this time I was like, oh, like let's just pop home and get it, Shane. It's okay. So we drive 20 minutes home, yep. get our wallets, and <laughs> drive back Drive back to Wegmans. We go in, we get our food, get sat down. It's been yeah. like four hours now <laughs> that we've done nothing. Um, we sit down to eat our meal, and I choke on a <laughs> first bite yeah like i inhale a grain of rice or something <laughs> which sets off a coughing fit that lasts the duration of lunch i am like coughing yep you didn't my, eat my lungs out yeah can't talk because i'm trying to like survive everyone around us is looking <laughs> like is he okay and i'm just like sitting there eating my food because there's nothing i can do <laughs> So I was just eating my food. Everyone was probably like, that doesn't look nice. <laughs> we went home, and we got right into bed and just, like, took a nap. Yeah. We were like, we're done with today. Yeah. Like, this is annoying. Yeah. Oh, God, but all of this yawning. Oh, okay. You're such a Chloe. Uh -uh. beautiful yawner. I'm not putting that in the video. I hope you do. <laughs> hey. Tell me you ruined it. That's enough. That's enough, Chloe. Stop. Okay? 
Remember when we used to yell at her and she would cower in fear and now she's like, huh? Huh? Can you stop please? Can you please stop? The other thing that's bothering her is we got our rats back and they're in that room with the door closed because Chloe really, really, really wants to just stare at them. Yeah. And we're oh. not allowing that. A lot of people thought we got rid of our rats. Oh yeah. Apparently in a previous video I said something that a lot of people thought I said really? we had taken them back to the pet store. Oh. But what we had actually the said was the pet sitter. Oh. A friend of ours watched the rats for us yeah. while we were in Florida and she brought them back. Yeah. Uh, so they're not gone. They yeah. still have the rats. Well, Chloe is overjoyed, but she's very frustrated that the door is closed. <laughs> we will be back on track with videos now. Uh, I don't, we don't really have like a set schedule. We try yeah. to do like every other day or so, but yeah. we took a little break because we were driving home. Mm -hmm. But now we're home. We're back in the swing of things. Yes. I'm going to go have my casserole now. Okay, Shane. All right. Hope you all have a good day. <laughs> Bye.